Good morning, everybody. It is Monday morning, December 1st. It certainly looks like December. Um, and so what I've decided to do is in the mornings when I have time, I'm just going to do a little Christmas kind of each morning. <laughs> That'll just be the way it's going to get done, I think. So this morning I did this kind of green. I have a different like a grapevine thing that I have up usually. So I take that down and put up some greens and then I put up the little village. My sister gave me that village a little piece each year for quite a few years. Um, so that's what I've done this morning while watching an episode of The Blacklist. Not the whole time. That didn't take me the whole time. But anyway. Okay. So outfit of the day. These are the boot cut jeans from not your mother's jeans. No, not your daughter's. I always say it the wrong way. Okay. So that's what that is. This is just a purple long sleeve t-shirt that I think I got at JCPenney quite a while ago. And this actually is a jacket I don't think I've ever worn. I, I, it's a Calvin Klein full leather. Got it at TJ Maxx. It has the, um, let me zip it. So it has like that ace. Is that an asymmetrical or is just, I don't know, whatever. The zip's way the heck over here. That's, <laughs> that's what that is. Um, I'm going to leave it open though. I've decided maybe if I can get it back open again. And then this necklace, I've had it forever. I wear it a bunch of different ways. I, I uh, circle it up. This is um, knotted, which is a suggestion from a friend. And yeah, and then these are just nothing special. These are like my boots that I wear when I know I'm gonna have to run errands and it's nasty outside. And then these earrings, let me see if you guys can see it here. Those were a gift from a subscriber a little while back. So yeah, and then my face is just very natural. Um, one of the color pop shadows on my lid, one in the crease and then the dark brown from the sleek palette is on my eyes and the purple liner from the Marc Jacobs gel liner set beneath my lower lash line and my lips is what I've been playing with. Um, check this out. I can't remember if I showed it before, but it's Vino lip liner from MAC. And then you'll see this in Tuesday. You will have already seen it. If I can, this looks jacked up right now because I put it over the liner, but Pervet lipstick. And then today I put a little Camp Cosmetics um, Lady Pimp over the top of it. So that is my look today. It is 13 after 7. The latest I can leave and still be on time. Not that I like punch a clock or anything, but you know, um, is 18 after. So. I'm going to get going so I don't cut it so close. Before I leave, I was going to show you. I have um, this one we need for breakfast, which is plain Greek yogurt with some pomegranates. And for lunch, I was trying to eat up some leftovers. So I have some broccoli, just plain broccoli, and then turkey. And then I have, I have two of these. I don't think I'm going to need to. What the heck? That was loud. I don't think I'm going to need two of these, but anyway, I'm just going to put this in there to kind of melt over the top of it. There's like, this is like 35 calories for one of these, but otherwise I'm afraid it's going to be too dry when I reheat it. I'm just eating random leftovers, <laughs> random turkey, broccoli, and some urban garlic cream, or not cream cheese, urban garlic, laughing cow cheese. Anyway, that's what's, that's what's for lunch. Good morning, everybody. It is quarter to seven, Tuesday morning. I just filmed my video for Thursday and I was packing up my stuff to show you guys. So let me show you the one in the bedroom. So we had to order a box for a TV in the kitchen because it won't, you can't just have it plugged into the wall anymore. You have to have a box now. So I thought that what I ordered was this teeny tiny box right here. See the teeny tiny box? That's what I asked for. I could tell I clearly had some sort of a trainee on my hands, um, which is fine, but I could just hear her asking other questions, like if somebody's sitting next to her or whatever. So the box we got is this ginormous box, and it's heavy, which tells me it's probably more like the box that we have in the living room, and I just don't want that up here, so I don't know what to do now. This is my dilemma for the morning. I um, am not doing any decorating this morning. Um, I just, when I'm, I'm, I think I'm only gonna be able to do that in the mornings when I'm, when I'm not filming, but I'm picking up some little styrofoam things. But anyway, so I just wanted to touch, touch base a little bit this morning. I still have not been able to edit 
Sunday's vlog. I had choir last night, um, which means that I left my house yesterday at whatever time, I don't remember. And it was so busy I didn't get a lunch yesterday at work. And it worked late, went right to choir, so I didn't get home till almost 7.30. And I just, I just didn't have it in me. So hopefully today, maybe on my lunch, I need to run an errand and then hopefully I'll be able to get back in time to edit the vlog and try to get that up yet today for you guys. Seriously. <laughs> Nothing like old information. So that was Sunday. Today's too. Yeah, I have to try to get it up today. Otherwise, maybe I just won't even put it up. But anyway. All right. So, yeah. I say anyway a lot. That's been mentioned to me a few times. I'm sorry. I don't know how else. I, it's just, it's become like my transition word. And I, I don't know how to get away from it. I'm trying. I swear I'm trying. All right. I'm off to work. I suppose I could show you an outfit of the day very quickly. Boring, the most boring outfit of the day known to man. I have to run errands on my lunch, so I'm wearing my Skecher tennis shoes. <laughs> sometimes I'll bring, focus. All right, sometimes I'll bring like these shoes along and wear booties, but I just, I just, I'm just not feeling it today. <laughs> so this is one of those Lane Bryant side zip sweaters that I have in multiple colors. This is the black one. These are those Jag jeans that I got from Zappos. So they're kind of that gunmetal color. And this necklace I got from The Loft. Earrings from Charming Charlie's. And today I have the Kevin Aquan, Kevin Aqua, take your pick. Everybody has an opinion. <laughs> um, blood Roses. Is that true? Yes, Blood Roses lipstick on. And on my eyes, I have the Bare Minerals Magic hat, but it's basically the Epiphany duo, you know. All right, I'm really leaving now. So I'm at work, and I can't remember if I showed you guys. I found these oatmeal things for the, for the Keurig. And I make oatmeal at work all the time, but I just thought this would be fun to try. So inside, there's a little, like, apple cinnamon, like, flavor. So that's the K-cup part. And there's the oatmeal package. And then a package of fruit and nuts. Looks like apples, almonds, and maybe cranberries, I think. Well, yes, Kristen. Apple, cinnamon, almond. But I think there's cranberries in there, too. Oh, yes, with cranberries. Anyway, I'm going to try it. Good morning, everybody. So, Wednesday morning. I was just filming... And the plow came through, like really loudly came through. And so it must have snowed last night. I can't really tell anymore. <laughs> this is the current state of the snow. And the sunrise. Getting there anyway. Tempting to rise. So, um, last night when I came home, no decorating occurred again. I needed to wrap up Chris's presents. I'm having lunch with Carissa today. It's her birthday. So... I was wrapping up her presents, and we had the turkey divan that I made this weekend. We had that last night, so that was good, because I could just pop it in the oven when I got home and then get to working on my stuff. And then I was editing a video, and yeah. I, I <laughs> There's just nothing to vlog at night, because it's really just a lot of me sitting around, doing things on my laptop. And um, I've not gotten on the treadmill in a few days either, so I need to I need to get on that. I was doing um I was watching the blacklist on the treadmill, so I need to get back at that. I think I'll be able to do that tonight. Like I said, I've just kind of decorated little bits and pieces here and there, um, and that was kind of my goal to do it in the mornings. But I just it's five to seven right now, and I just film finished filming for Saturday, so I am done filming for the week. Which is nice. I may be able to do some more stuff then during the mornings here. Um, but I, sh I should have most of the day on Saturday. I can't think of any commitments that I have this Saturday. I, I actually don't think I have any. So uh, we're going to get the tree and everything. But I will be fine. I'm not sure why I'm telling you guys as if you're worried. Because guess who's the one that's worried? It's me. <laughs> I'm trying to convince myself that we'll be fine. Pack up my lunch. I'm having some um, yogurt with pomegranate seeds in it for breakfast and lunch with Carissa. So I just have to grab a protein bar and some fruit and a string cheese or some vegetables and a string cheese and I will be out the door. I'm actually hoping my video is uploading here. 
or my footage is uploading, so I have four minutes before that for, before that is uploaded. And I'll edit it tonight and whatnot, so everything should be all set to go. I like that. I like it better when I'm on top of things and I don't have to be like editing and uploading Saturday morning for Saturday's video. That gives me heart palpitations. <laughs> I like to have things right on top of things. And I gotta tell you, what I normally do over here, I don't know if you saw me looking at this a couple of times, but something is askew over here. See this? My greenery? I don't know. Something's not right. It's too heavy on the right hand side or something. I mean, I want it to, to look nice. I can't even talk today. I want it to look nice, but not perfect, you know? You don't want it to be, to be too perfect, but still be perfect. <laughs> All right then, I'll check in with you guys later. So I forgot outfit of the day. Of course my camera just shut off on me again. I will, I, I'm getting a new one. Oh, by the way, I had somebody um, say to me that it looked like my camera was more dark and out of focus lately. Oh, it's not the camera, it's just the weather. <laughs> That's just, just the way it is because so much of our day um, is spent in darkness here in Wisconsin now. <laughs> not darkness, but you know what I mean. Okay. Okay, so not your daughter's jeans, which I should probably just stop mentioning because you've seen them 800 times. These are the ones without the butt interest. I have a pile of clothes behind me to go to the Goodwill, by the way. I've been cleaning again. This is jacket from Lane Bryant. I really like this jacket a lot. It has a little bit of stretch to it, but nice structure at the same time. I like that. This top is just uh, sleeveless which I'm probably going to regret because I'm going to freeze my keister off, but it has kind of this drape cowl necky sort of thing. So because of that, I didn't wear a necklace. I didn't, I maybe, maybe I'll put on the cross Bob gave me. But anyway, and then these earrings are from Charming Charlie's. Shocker, I know. And my eyes are the Becca Nude, Ombre Nude palette, which I just talked about in a video. And on my lips is Bite Beauty Pomegranate, the lip pencil thingy. So um, all right, so that's, I think that's everything. Good morning, everybody. It is Friday morning. Happy Friday, although you're seeing this probably on Saturday, so happy Saturday. Um, anyway, I got, again with the anyway, I got two more of these shears, you know, that I've been showing you in my bedroom. I just felt like they needed to, I was talking to my mom on Thanksgiving and just felt like they needed more, it needed more oomph there than I could pull it over to the sides. For, anyway, the point is, I might, beautiful ironing board here out and I'm going to, I just finished getting ready so I'm going to get these ironed and get those up before I go to work today. That's the plan and oops I don't need all of that and tonight we are going for fish. We weren't going to but Bob and I for sure are going and then um, Kim is iffy. I was supposed to hear from her last night but didn't so she'll tell me today. And I'm not sure about Wiser either. So, but anyway, Bob and I have decided that we are going. We're going to a little bit nicer place into quote unquote nicer. It's like a supper club versus a uh, tavern or a bar. So that's the plan. We'll take you along. See what Bobby has to say tonight. I'm gonna iron some curtains. I'll show you when I'm done. Okay. So I like this much better now. Um, I ended up. I couldn't find a binder clip like you guys were talking about. I mean, I'm sure I have them like. I just don't have one here. <laughs> so I actually just used a safety pin behind it to hold those together. So that makes me happy. And so now I have four of these sheer panels instead of just two. So it fills up the space here because if you're new to the vlogs, I am curtain deficient and I've never used these before. And we should have bolted these in closer to the wall, but I didn't realize what I was doing at the time. I had the curtains flip flopped. Anyway, it's a whole ordeal. So, um, I don't, I don't want to, I don't want to take them out and then have this big, like I have to try to repair the holes and that sort of thing. And Bob has to do it. And I don't want to, I don't want to bug him to have to drill the holes again because I am a dork and don't know how to hang curtains or don't know how to put tie thing. Anyway, you know what I'm saying? So, um, this I think works well. The only thing that I'm unhappy with currently is that it's hard for me to get the seam, you know, because these are two panels here. It's hard for me to get that properly like hidden. So I might take it in and have somebody sew it together. I haven't decided yet. See this one, I don't know. It's not too bad. I'm very, I'm very happy with the fact that it looks better and it's done now. So it's quarter to seven. And I think I might, you know, I like to leave by 7. I don't have to leave typically till 7.15. So I might wash my brushes because I didn't get to do it last weekend. No, I could have done it. I didn't do it. 
Um, outfit of the day is not very exciting. I'll show you very quickly. I don't have any jewelry on yet, but you guys have seen this before. This is that... I can't remember what this is called, but it's just a long, like, cardigan duster. Look, I don't even have shoes on yet. <laughs> um, duster, I think, and it has the full leather right here. Um, I have the Becca Ombre Nudes palette on my eyes. Again, only I used Ice Latte from L'Oreal, the infallible, on my lids. And this is Bite Beauty Scarlet in that dual-ended um, lipstick thingy for the holidays. $12. All right, I'm gonna go see if I can get some brushes washed. At least maybe I can wash my face brushes. All right, it is just about five o'clock. Look at him. Dipping around with his phone like he thinks he's me. Say hello. Hello, everybody. <laughs> I sent him a text this morning just to see if he would respond to it. And he did. Um, this was what I washed this morning, by the way, my brushes. Um, I don't know why I have taken to doing my eye brushes like this, but anyway. Um, this was a better, maybe a better shot of my outfit of the day. I just threw a little necklace with some color on it. Because <laughs> I was feeling a tad gray this morning. I've worn a lot of black and gray this week. Anyway, I wanted to show you, Vicki, you're so in trouble with me. <laughs> um, I got a couple things in the peel box. So... I go to my P.O. box once a week, usually just on Fridays. And last week I had to go Wednesday because of Thanksgiving and everything. So I hadn't been for a while. And I went and um, Vicki sent me the NARS Ida brush or Ida brush, which I am pretty excited about. It was always out of stock whenever I looked and I just kind of gave up. Um, and she sent me from Sephora. I'm really excited about this because Emily's been raving about this. The Becca Glow to Go Shimmering Skin Perfector Kit. And then um, the Tarte Gifted Mascara. And now I've tried this before and it transferred on me. But I'm using different eye creams and stuff now. So um, I'm excited to give that a go. And this whole box of a whole bunch of different like point perks that she um, had put in there. Um, you should be using those points on yourself, not on me. Um, and then she sent me a couple of candles. This one is so, it smells like, it's smelling in my car. I can't tell if it's, I feel like it's lilies or something. Let me see if it says. It's jasmine and honeysuckle. It's not lilies. But anyway, it says on it, um, friends fill your life with joy and your soul with sunshine and your heart with love. So I thought that was really neat. And then I opened this in the car already and I put it to get back together because I wanted to show you. Um, it's this kit or this set of three wick candles and they all have different scents um, and they all smell really, really good. So, so, so cute. And they'll just, how gorgeous are those for Christmas and just for, for all of winter because of those colors are just kind of wintry colors. So, so Vicki, thank you so much. You're so in trouble with me. Just wait till you get a message from me. Um, okay, and then I had a package um, from Kathy is her name. I just want to make sure that, yep, Kathy. And um, she sent me some, she's from Canada, sent me some Liz Watier, I believe is how you say it. And I love their lip liners. And these are some eye pencils, which I haven't tried, so that's exciting. Something called Sweet Lips, which I've not seen before. And a quad that she said she had just kind of gently used, and it's in champagne and chocolate so look at those colors like those are made for blue eyes and then there she sent me another let me open this palette okay i'm going to show you this palette isn't this beautiful and this is the glamour rose palette i think she said it was maybe from christmas uh, i just read her note no i can't remember but look how pretty Gorgeous, very, very gorgeous. Um, and the, the the bag, the envelope was open, so I don't know if Customs opened it to check or not, but that was what was in there. And Kathy, thank you so much. I really um, I appreciated your note, and I wanted you to know that I'll be thinking about you and praying for you. So, okay, and then the next package, and really sweet letter and Christmas card was from Sarah, but and she was she's in Canada too. Um, and she sent me, she had, she has problems with face masks. They tend to burn her face, you know, 
not like burn, like burn off her, but you know how if you put something on your face, you know what I'm saying. Anyway, so she sent me some face masks that weren't, that um, she thought that I would like, and then a really, really sweet letter. So, um, and Sarah, I will work on that video. She was asking me for a video on how to pair lips with eyes. Like, um, like how I pick what lips to do with what eye look or whatever. So I'm, I'll work on that. I'm not a makeup artist, you know, but I'll see what I can do. <laughs> I don't claim to be a makeup artist by any means. So thank you guys so, so much. You know that you don't need to do that and just watching and even just the letter is a blessing to me. So truly, but thank you. I, it's very, very generous of you. Um, okay. <laughs> I get all, getting all emotional. So we are headed out for fish. As I said earlier, we're headed to um, a place we haven't gone to in a while. Actually, I don't think we've been there. Have we been to Nella since my birthday? Like, not this past birthday, but the, almost two years ago. Oh, yeah, we went for Kurt's birthday. That's right. We don't go very often. It's a supper club in Shano. And they have really good salad bar, which is all that I will have. Because otherwise, well, honey, it's too much food. Well, I'm sorry. <laughs> but their salad bar is really, really good. It is. It is. You seem to be a little bit full of sass. Did you say goodbye to me this morning? Yep. I don't remember it. No swearing on the vlog. I just had to edit it because I'm swearing on my vlog again. I mean, really. Um, yeah, no, he always kisses me before he goes to bed, and it's usually about 15 minutes before I get up, or before he leaves, I mean. And it's about 15 minutes before I get up. Um, and I don't have any recollection of it this morning. I didn't sleep very well last night. So I was maybe in a funny sleep pattern or something. Did I say anything funny? No. Did I say I'll see you tonight? <laughs> well, I always want to wish him have a nice to have a nice day. I almost. <laughs> anyway, with that, we are gonna get going, and uh, we'll check back in with you later. My camera just shut off on me again. <laughs> we are home now. It is ten after eight. I am really tired. Um, Bob's going out to have a stogie. I did not vlog at dinner. It wasn't, um, because it's a little bit nicer, it would be a little bit weirder, I think, to pull out the camera there. <laughs> so I didn't vlog. What do you have to say about that? What? That I didn't vlog at dinner at all. Yeah, let's drop the ball. I, dro <laughs> I dropped the ball. I had to look, I thought my camera shut off. It did not. Tomorrow is getting the Christmas tree and getting the tree up and hopefully getting some stuff done outside. Christmasifying, which I said I was going to do last weekend, but didn't. So that's what's going down tomorrow. So hopefully we shall have some good, fun footage, huh? Should. Should. All right. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope that you had a great week and you enjoyed the pieces throughout the week. And we will talk to you very soon. Bye. Bye-bye.